Oh my gosh. It's here. It's here. Mm. Hello. Welcome back to another Dev Adventures. We're going to open up some cards. I recently ordered these and I am super excited. I've been wanting to build some more decks and uh, I thought it was about time to do something new. So that's what this is. And I actually have more coming. I probably spent too much money on cards, but I wanted to build a new deck. I'm building a Momir Vig. I'm excited. I'm super excited for what's in this. And I'm even more excited to get the rest of it. I'm also building a uh, Kaneo Sintero of Milides deck. A group hug deck. And oh my gosh, I am really excited for that one. That one's going to be awesome. I got some really good cards. Our man is going to be tapping for like five. We're all going to be drawing. But that's for another video. This is now. I'm super excited. Let's just let's stop talking. Let's stop talking. I didn't I didn't come prepared for this, so I don't have anything to open this up with. So we're just gonna try and use brute force. I'm a weakling! Never mind. <laughs> try and stand against this. Well, not too not too low, because I don't want to cut into anything important. Gosh dang it, just 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 come on. There we go. Oh, no, okay, need some more, we need some more loving. Let's open it gingerly. Ooh, list. No one wants to see a list. Devin, what are you doing? I am so excited. Now I got these cards. I'm actually getting the other set of cards on Thursday. Tomorrow is my birthday, so all of the stuff's coming right in between. Oh, that's just protection, I guess. That was disappointing. Like I was saying, I'm building a Momir Vig deck. And, uh, all this is for that. Weaver of Currents. I thought that might be good. I got a, a ooh, I think I saw the good stuff back there. I got a whole nother playset of, like, uh, mana dorks because, if you didn't know, I kind of love my elves. And so, uh, oh, Eva. Kiro's follower. So awesome. So I got another playset of elves just because these go in everything. And... They go in all three, they're, I mean, these will go well in all three decks that I'm building, so. Soul of the Harvest. Oh, Edric! All the good stuff, I'm so excited! Let me get it in shot. I thought Soul of the Harvest might be good. What is going on with, like, this autofocus? I don't like that, that's weird. Anyway, Soul of the Harvest. Pretty cool. Freaking Edric, Spy Master of Trust. That's gonna be good. Oh, I'm so excited to build this deck. All of these cards look really good so far. We got the Felwar Stone. You know, I thought that might be a, a good one. Felwar Stone. Got another Team or Saber Tooth, just because that's... If you're noticing a pattern, like a lot of my decks have this stuff. And they're just fantastic to have. Oh, no. Come on, what are you doing? What are you doing? Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Oh, what are you doing, Edric? Stop that. Warren Power Stone. A really bad... Soul Ring, but uh, it's cheaper than a lot of the other um, rocks out there. <gasps> Thran Dynamo! That one's better. Well, Thran Dynamo! Pretty cool. <gasps> What's this? Oh. Venser, Shaper, Savant. Freaking awesome! I will probably go over these cards in further detail later on. This is kind of just a little opening to show you what I got to get you excited for the decks coming up. Uh, this is this will be a good one. Uncage the Menagerie. Search your library for up to X creature cards with different names that each have a converted mana cost X. Reveal them, put them onto your hand, then shuffle your library. That's kind of cool. So cool. Rashmi. Wanted to get the Rashmi. I thought she would be good. I mean, that's that is going to be good. Rashmi, Eternity's Crafters. I mean, I'm going to be casting all the spells. I'm going to be looking at all the cards. Doing all the things. I am so excited to build this new deck. All three of you go. Oh, <gasps> Dusquatch Recruiter. 
And oh, 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 let me just drop it. There's the flip side. I thought that might be kind of cool. All of these might not make it into the deck, but I was going through and I was like, ooh, this looks good. This looks good. I like this. Hedron Archive. Again, shitty soul ring, but I mean, ooh, look at that. Look at that. Hedron Archive. Pretty cool. And you have a Maya Coast. That one's a good one. I got a couple lands. I got a lot of creatures, some instant sorceries. You know, I just got like a. Oh, oh. Oh, my dude. Shaman of Forgotten Ways. Even my coast. Pretty awesome. And Shaman of Forgotten Ways. This is just a fantastic card. I really didn't want to have to switch back and forth. I was tired of switching decks back and forth. That's why I'm kind of building the ones that I am. That's why I got some of the mana dorks. Just because, uh. I want to have separate decks. I want to be able to pull out Yisin, play it when I want. I want to be able to pull out Momir Vig. I don't want to have to switch cards back and forth. There might be a couple. I'm thinking of doing like Crater Hoof in here. I don't know though. This autofocus. What is going on here? I don't like this. Sorry if it's all shaky. It's kind of weird. But anyway, Shaman of Forgotten Ways. Such a good card. Ooh, what's this? Plasm Capture? I forgot what some of these do. Counter target spell at the beginning of your next pre combat main phase. Ah! Whoa, what was that? X is a spell to convert mana cost. Okay, so yeah, it's counter spell, then I get mana. I mean, it's it's You know, I actually didn't realize that that was running until just now. I hope that doesn't have a lot of noise on the uh Arbor Elf. Again, another mana dork. <gasps> Spellbook. No max hand size for zero. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Real Druid. You know, the foil Bereal Druid goes from like 20 cents to $25. I would love to foil out my deck with these elves, but the elves are ridiculously expensive. So, uh, ooh, what's this? Oh, what's this? Ooh, my 7th edition Llanowar Elves. What else we got? Wild Growth. Um, yeah, just doubles your mana. I mean, that's kind of cool, right? I like that. What else do we got? What is this? Oh, Cloud of Fairies. Hi, Cloud of Fairies. Untap up to two lands. So this is going to be a kind of a combo piece with potentially like Team or Sabretooth up there. If my lands tap for double, I can just, you know, bounce it. Untap lands, infinite mana, do the things. Kind of cool. Oh, Capsize with buyback. What else do we got? What's it? What, what's it? What, what, what is it? Black creatures cannot attack you. What, what is this? Oh, elephant grass. I forgot I got this one. Black creatures cannot attack you. Non-black creatures cannot attack you. So just nothing can attack me. Unless our controller pays an additional two for each attacking creature. That's kind of cool. That's going to be good in my uh, group hug deck. You know? It's got a cumulative upkeep, but that's fine. I should have enough mana, more than enough mana to pay for it, and I don't want people attacking me, you know? <gasps> what's this? <gasps> Sisse's Ring. Why did I get Sisse's Ring? I had to get another Priest of Titania, you know? Priest of Titania is just a really good card. Familiar Ruse. That's pretty good. I am okay with bouncing a creature to my hand to counter a spell. That is pretty fantastic. Instant, like... Oh yeah, that's good. What else we got? Oh, what's this? <gasps> Mystic Snake, counter target spell. Pretty good. It's expensive, but I mean it's got flash. That's gonna be really good. Is there? Oh, there's one. There's two more. There's two more. Is there two more? Yep, there's two more. So Mystic Snake, we're almost to the end here. Got some good stuff. I am super excited to build the deck. Look out for um, deck techs coming up. I think I'm going to do another deck tech for Yisin. Just because it's changed so much, so much since the last one, and I haven't done one in so long. And I'm going to be doing uh, a couple new deck techs for uh, Kaneos. Can, 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 I don't know what I don't know how to pronounce his name. KTM, whatever. I don't know. Pestermite enters the battlefield. Untap or tap target permanent. Another combo piece like that is going to be pretty fantastic. If I've got infinite mana, um. That's going to be really good. And, okay, so this is going to be the drum roll, please. I want to look at the back of it, see uh, see how the back of it looks. It looks okay. It's, I mean, it's a bit beat up. It's 
got some wear along the edges there, but it's not too bad. What is going on with this autofocus? Oh my gosh. This is not going to be as exciting for you as it is for me, but I've... I thought this is going to be like the most expensive card that I bought out of all of this, but I really wanted another one, and I really liked um, the symbol on it. Do you know what it is? Can you guess what it is? Down in the comments below, tell me, what do you think this is going to be? There's a little sneak peek. Birds of Paradise. That goes over there. Revised Birds of Paradise with uh, the tap symbol. I really like the tap symbol. You know, Birds of Paradise goes well just about in any deck. I would say run one in every single deck that you have because it is pretty fantastic. Let me, uh, actually, I'll be right back. I really like old cards. I like the old stuff, you know. I like uh, Onslaught. I like 7th Edition. Ice Age. I mean... This deck is completely snowed out. Let me just show you here. Ooh, see, look at that. Oh, no, wrong one. Onslaught Wirewood Lodge. I'm gonna do another deck tech about this uh, deck so that you guys can see the updated version. I'm just looking for it, there it is. I'm slowly going to get an army of birds. Seventh edition birds, revised birds, both white border. Some people don't like that. I don't mind it too much. Oh, I really like the artwork on this one. So pretty. And then I just really wanted the tap symbol on this one. Nice. Super excited to build this deck. I hope you guys are excited to see the decks. Look for those coming up in the near... Oh, what? There's like... There's like... I spit on this card. Oh, my poor birds. It's not going to be able to fly now. It's all wet. I hope you look forward to those videos coming out in the near future. I want to be doing a few different deck techs. I want to be showing you guys all the stuff that I'm building. I'm probably going to be doing a couple more open up... Uh, open up videos that doesn't make sense i'm probably going to be uh, uh, i'm going to be doing a couple more box opening videos i ordered more things than i should have like i said i'm going to get the other package on thursday thank you for joining me i hope you liked this little box opening package opening seeing the awesome cards that i got look out for the next one these will all be in the playlists i put everything into playlists if you didn't know um so if you want to see any verses any box openings, Friday Night Magics, they're all in playlists. Go check them out. Also, don't forget to check out the giveaway in the description below. It's down there. I'm pointing at um, something, but it's down there <laughs> in the description. <laughs> the last video went well. People seem to like the uh, double jointedness. Um, people seem to like the angle of being in the garage here. That, that got some good uh, feedback so far. So thank you guys for commenting. Again, comment on the videos. It lets me know that you guys like what I'm doing. And, uh, yeah. I think we'll see you in the next one, guys. I want to I wanna quit talking here because I'm just I'm excited. I got my birds. Super excited. I really like the artwork on this one more, though. But I like the tap symbol. <laughs> yeah. Tap it, tap it, tap, tap, tap. <laughs>